the name of Allah, the most merciful, let's start our class, hello everyone, welcome to one, to our English class. Our subject today is, where is Davy? Mysteries left off. Hello everyone, listen to our listen with the warm-up question. Look at the poster, this is the poster everybody. Who wrote it and why? Who wrote it? What do you think? And why? Let's read it together. Lost a parrot on Thursday, 1st of October. Please phone Oxford 287366. 10 years reward for information. What do you think? Who wrote it? And why? Do you know? Let's see. Listen to the phone conversation. Why is Nina happy? Hello, is that Oxford 287366? Yes, it is. Did you put a notice in the shop window about a lost parrot? No, but my mum did. Well, I have good news. I have him. You have him? Yes, he was sitting in the tree in my garden. I couldn't catch him at first. But I put some bird food on the ground and he came down and ate it. Then I could catch him. Tell me your address and I can bring him round. Oh, thank you, thank you. This is the happiest day of my life. Mum, that was a woman on the phone. She has Davy. OK, nice. Nice, so. So... Of course, Nina wrote a poster. She's happy because why? She found Davy. She found Davy. Okay, what happened to Davy? Put the sentences into the correct order. Let's read it together. A. Davy came down and ate it. B. Davy was sitting in a tree in the women's garden. Number one, at the starter. C, she phoned Nina. D, she put some bird food on the ground. E, then the woman could catch him. F, the woman couldn't catch him at first. Okay, everybody. See the answers. A, four. B1, as we say, Davy was sitting in a tree in the woman's garden. C, number two. F2, the woman couldn't catch him at first. Three is D, she put some bird food on the ground. A4, Davy came down and ate it. E5, then the woman could catch him. Last one, C6. She found Nina. She found Nina. Okay, got it? From the conversation, all the story. Okay, now, right. Complete the sentences, use could or couldn't. Able or not able to, okay? The past, could, in the past. Can, could, can't, couldn't. Okay, one. Davy flew out of the window. Nina's mother couldn't stop him. Couldn't, okay? Two, Yasser planned to do his homework because he was at the hospital all night. So, good or couldn't? What do you think? Number three, he was at the hospital all the time. Number three, we must speak English when she went to England. Yes, she planned. What do you think? Could or could it? And before one night, Rico planned to see a person with a torch and style. With a torch and style. I see the answer. Number one, of course, couldn't. Number two, couldn't. Yes, he couldn't do his homework because he was at the hospital. That's why he couldn't. Number three, could. 
Rima speak English with a question. We use could. We don't use couldn't. Okay. Could Rima speak English when she went to England? Yes, she could. Yes. Because yes, she could. Okay. Before, if there's no, no, she couldn't. Okay. Yes, she could. Before one night, Rico could see a person with a torch and style. Torch and style. Okay? It's the end of our class today. Put the story in the correct order after reading sentences. Then we use and put could and couldn't in the blank. The suitable answer. Okay? Do it again. Practice, practice, practice. And see you next class, everybody. Goodbye.